some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Harrison Township, Ohio, with a frauditor who uh, goes by the name of Audits Ohio, as he attempts to walk up on an officer who is uh, minding his own business, of course, only for the officer to take notice that the uh, frauditor is uh, committing a traffic infraction and jumps into action. But of course, the frauditor refuses to answer questions and ends up with a shiny new pair of bracelets. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Huh? These ones make for good ones too, man. Huh? These ones make for good ones when I walk up on them like this. Yeah, you gotta love it when frauditors decide to film their own crimes. He's showing clear intent that he's gonna cause an issue with the officer to begin with. But as we shall soon see, the officer is going to get the upper hand by uh, pointing out a traffic infraction that he is currently committing. Is it dead? Yeah, damn near. Or almost. Not damn you. I'm gonna hit him with. We got a call about a suspicious vehicle. Oh, so you were going to attempt to impersonate an officer by feigning a call about a suspicious vehicle? Okay, then. Not very bright, uh, and probably would have been funny if you had been caught doing that, but it's not gonna make it that far. So let's go ahead and continue on with this crayon muncher stupidity. It's right there. Yeah. He might be on the call to that house. God damn, you're right. Shit. It's alright. Think so? No. <laughs> no, he might be. Whew. So, going to view? Do you suspect me of you suspect me of committing a crime? Yep. What crime? Walking the roadway. Walking the roadway. You got your ID on you? Yeah, it sounds a bit crazy, but believe it or not, there's an Ohio statute that does say that this is illegal. Section 451150 of the traffic code, pedestrian uh, walking and roadway. Paragraph A, where a sidewalk is provided and it is uh, practicable, it shall be unlawful for any pedestrian to walk along and upon an adjacent roadway. Paragraph B, where a sidewalk is not available, any pedestrian walking along and upon a highway shall only walk on a shoulder as far as practicable from the edge of the roadway. Paragraph C, where neither a sidewalk nor a shoulder is available, any pedestrian walking along and upon a highway shall walk as near as practicable to an outside edge of the roadway, and if on a two-way roadway, shall only walk on the left side of the roadway. What's your roadway is a crime. Do what? This one is walking the roadway is a crime. It is a crime. How is that a crime? Can I get a supervisor? For what? For what? Because yeah. I ain't done nothing wrong. Yeah, you're walking on the roadway. 
Yep. So the way here, let me explain the law to you. The way the the way the law is with pedestrians in the roadway, if the sidewalk's not provided, you have to walk in the opposite lane of travel, right? So if you're walking this way, you have to you have to be on the, the east side of the road. Make sense? Yeah. So technically, frauditor, if you had been on the left hand side of the road and on the grass, the officer would not have been able to touch you, but you would have been able to do your normal frauditing BS and antagonize them to your heart's content for clicks and views, but now you are refusing to identify, which brings us to another infraction that you are committing, which is section 2921.29, failure to disclose personal information according to the Ohio Revised Code, paragraph A, no person who is in a public place shall refuse to disclose the person's information person's name address date or date of birth when requested by a law enforcement officer who reasonably suspects either of the following the person is committing has committed or is about to commit a criminal offense now albeit a traffic offense is a very minor crime it is still a crime nonetheless therefore you are to id to the officer in this scenario and according to ohio state statutes it is a uh, another misdemeanor right there to not identify yourself to the officer so you are just one Big screw up after another. You uh, apparently failed to recognize the law about walking on the uh, roadway. And you wanted to be a dipstick about identifying to the officer in this scenario. Which it's clearly a scenario where you have to identify. So you pretty much had this one coming. So enjoy your walk of shame. Yep. What law is that? I'll pull it up for you. You got your ID on you? Yeah, uh... I'm not ID, man. You're not gonna identify yourself. No. Well, I'm gonna issue you a citation, so you have to identify yourself. You're gonna give me a citation yep. for what? I just told you. You don't have your ID. On the wrong side of the road. For walking on the side of the road. Walking in the road. I need to talk to a supervisor. I want to speak to your. Yeah. Well, you're gonna stand over here for a second, and I'm gonna get you a citation. Okay? Come stand over here for me. Thank you. And what, what, you don't have your ID on you? No. Huh? No. What's your social? I'm, I need to speak to a supervisor first. No, I'm asking you to, to, for, I'm asking you to identify yourself. No, let's I not, don't. Let's not make it a lot harder. I need to talk to a supervisor, okay. sir. Well, that's what we're going to do. You're going to take you in the back of my cruiser, okay? Until you want to identify yourself, we can make this a lot, it can be a lot easier, partner. Either identify yourself. It'll be a lot easier not bother us. I'm not bothering you. Yeah, you, you are. Huh? You're walking up the street. I'm not walking up the street. Yeah, I wasn't impeding traffic. I wasn't doing anything wrong. Do you have your ID? I wasn't doing anything wrong. I've already told you. I believe this is an unlawful command. No, it's not. How ain't it? You committed a crime. I didn't commit a crime. You're in the roadway, and I'm going to issue a citation for that street in the roadway. I need to speak to a supervisor. Do what? I want to speak to a supervisor. Give me your ID. Huh? Who's going to give you a citation for fucking... I need to speak to a supervisor. You were. No one. Yes, was parked right on the side. No, not a feeding trap. You were way off the sidewalk. No. Yeah. Okay. You got your ID on you? I need to speak to a supervisor first. You don't have your ID on you? I need You're to not going to identify yourself? I don't answer questions. You're not going to identify yourself? I'm asking you to questions. identify yourself. I don't answer questions. Okay. Well, do me a favor. Turn around. Put hey, your other hand on your back. We can record. That's fine. Use your other hand. Walking up the street, this guy's so bored. Walking in the middle of the road. We're not walking right, in the middle of the road. You were parked we're in the middle of the road. We're gonna figure out who you are, partner. Dozens of kids do this every day. This 
It's the same cop, cop that told my friend that he hates me. Personal feeling, hate. Same one. Same one. Can't bring your feelings to work, man. It's in front of my house and just wait. Plenty of criminals out here. And well, there you have it, folks. Another moronic frauditor cuffed and stuffed. I mean, okay, I can understand the issue about uh, not understanding the law to begin with in this scenario, but if you hadn't acted like such a fraud or a prick, you would have been put in handcuffs and uh, put in the back of a squad car. That's on you, dude. You only got yourself to blame. At any rate, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one.